mother, daughter, sister, aunt. Our bodies have become canvases painted with blood. Our trust has been lost to fists supplied without heart. Mother, daughter, sister, aunt. Will I have to listen to my daughter whisper? I'm afraid, Mama. Why does he scream those ugly things, Mama? I cannot save her for how long will it take for her screams to turn into beating. Mother, daughter, sister, aunt. My aunt screamed at me today. Until I forgot my own name, I forgot my identity, my lost legs went lame, you see. It's not only men who can beat pulp. It's women too, and we need to stand up. Mother, daughter, sister, aunt. How many hospital visits? How many terry blood-stained nights? How many broken beer bottles? How many mornings spent covering bruises with makeup? How many questions? How many visits to apathetic policemen? How many silent lambs? How many lives must be lost to abuse till South Africa stands up? Mother, Daughter, sister, aunt. I don't want these women to die. I don't want women of South African rainbow blood to be lost to blows and words. I don't want women made out of stardust and warm couscous to be lost to abuse. They are women who have hearts like Table Mountain, large, lush, and unbreakable. These women have skin of every shade, but they are shadowed by something so vile and so dark that I hope and pray they'll be able to see the light again. Their identity is being shoved into the waters of our South African ocean so deep that we often forget it is even happening. Their identity has become a sinking rock and we have forgotten that everybody deserves to swim. Everybody deserves to swim. Every woman deserves to swim. They deserve to float on their back and grasp at all the stars in the sky. Their identity must be protected. Woman must be protected. And it's up to us to protect their identity.